Thailand. It's what northeast of Thai, uh, Bangkok. There's the prison, Sesiket prison, over yonder. And here is a garden that the prisoners have been. They've cleared all this land. That was all completely full of bamboo and all sorts, and it's all boggy. They've managed to drain it all off, put in this bank here with these bridges going across. This is all all been done recently. I'm assuming it's all reclaimed stuff, or well, most of it's reclaimed. Obviously, the concrete posts are probably not. But yeah, it's beautiful, and it's only just been done. So you imagine what it's going to be like in a year or two when everything's got a hold and it's more established. And I think looking at what's over here, I say some of that could be vegetables. I'm not sure. What do you reckon? I think it is. We've got all these little huts. Little hut there. Yeah. This little uh it goes on across here. I have to forgive the, uh, the bouncy camera work. I haven't got my gimbal -y extension handheld device. So I have to forgive the jumpiness. But that's all been cleared as well. Leading up there. You couldn't see halfway up there. In fact, you couldn't even see as far as this, the end of this structure here that they've put up. So they've cleared all that pathway all the way up the top there, and what, 100 metres if not more. And clearing all this, obviously it's still in a work in progress, obviously all this ditch here will obviously all be cleaned out. And, you know, we've got a little bridge here. Already the vines already started to grow over it. Yeah. A love seat that they've put in. Obviously like I say, it's all work in progress. This is all next to the prison, and that's all the inmates do this. I've seen prisoners out here working, and occupied by, or unsupervised, shall I say, by any prison officers at all. A little love heart seat there, look. But yeah, there's a... Uh, that's what the prisoners get up to. Unsupervised gardening. I'm sure they'll obviously have a bit of a briefing as beforehand as to what to, needs to be done and such like. But yeah, unsupervised, working outside. They could literally walk off at any point they chose. And uh, <laughs> obviously now here in Thailand, the broccoli is legal. Um, so obviously you can you know, do what you want with that, kind of, as you may, under health conditions. And there's literally just behind me, just there, just around the corner, there's a shop that obviously sells alcohol and everything else. But also, just a little bit further up, is a uh, broccoli shop. So, yeah, you could even go out of prison, talk, take a walk around the corner, get yourself some of the the broccoli and have a little blaze. I'm not sure, I'm assuming though that no one dare risk doing that. The repercussions, but you never know. I mean, temptation is always there. And at the end of the day, prisoners in Thailand pay for everything themselves, like food-wise. So, uh, would it be frowned upon? I don't know. Possibly, possibly not. I mean, there's literally, I say, just there behind me, there's a shop that sells alcohol. Obviously, with the restricted times as there is in Thailand. But yeah, there we go. Just thought I'd share that with you. TTFN.